the man is cursed. As soon as he touches Coca-Cola, it turns into Pepsi, but he swore he'd rather die than drink Pepsi. He tries using tongs to pick up the cola. No color change, so it's safe to drink. But, surprise, right after a sip, the cola changes color again. He spits it out instantly. Frustrated, he goes to the fridge and empties all the cola inside. Suddenly, he spots two cans of red cola at the bottom. Wearing a glove, he takes it out pours it into a cup and tries to drink. But, the bottled cola turns blue again. The man has no choice but to accept reality. He starts sipping on the Pepsi, and just at that moment, Earth inexplicably meets its demise. A guy is taking a leak, accidentally activates the camera and captures a private moment. In a panic, he mistakenly shares the video on social media, frantically trying to delete it. He fumbles and, whoops, his phone dives into the toilet, frantically fishing it out. He realizes 10% of the video has already been uploaded. He goes nuts, tapping and swiping, but nothing's working. He smashes the screen, hoping to stop the upload, but it just speeds up. He unplugs all the cables, forgetting about the phone's built-in data, helplessly watching the progress reach 20%. He's on a mad race, wielding a chainsaw, destroying the signal tower, but the upload keeps going. Losing his sanity, he storms a signal management center, tackles the boss, then, kaboom, grenade launched. The satellite turns into dust, nail-biting, he stares at the screen. No surprise, it's uploaded. Mocking messages from strangers start pouring in. The man finally loses it. This dude rips off his shirt and lets out a roar. He strikes a series of poses, proudly displaying the cheat notes covering his body. Everyone in class copies furiously, some even with both hands. Later the exam hall returns to normal, but the cheating war is just getting started. A boy casually pulls a strand of his curly hair, revealing the hidden answers underneath. A hot girl takes off her glasses and her earrings. She holds the earring close to her nail. The concealed answers are magnified. The one-eyed boy opens his jacket aside, pulls down his eye patch, and captures all the answers in his sight. Some even print the answers onto wood to make pencils. This girl just needs to be cockeyed. She can see the answers woven into the clothes, erasers, pencil cases, watches. The cheating tools come in all shapes and sizes, but the principal had an eye on everything. This guy shows up to the exam, with his entire body covered in plaster. A camera extends from his chest, directly capturing the exam paper and sending it to an accomplice. Once the accomplice calculates the answers, they remotely transmit them to the student. Everyone uniformly covers their ears to receive the answer. The teacher, with a 2000 degree vision, doesn't notice anything unusual, taking advantage of the teacher's distraction. A girl folds her exam paper into an airplane and tosses it out the window. Downstairs, an accomplice catches the paper and writes the answers on balloons, floating them back up, even on the neighboring rooftop. Several female students use their bodies to form the exam answers. Outside, someone is using a gun to observe the test questions, and then projecting the answers with infrared light. Instantly, all the students start furiously writing, Do you have any bizarre cheating methods? After taking off her shoes, the woman's toes look surprisingly distorted. She really loves these blue shoes. Her foot size is a whopping US 15, but she insists on wearing them. With a satisfied grin, she strolls down the street, but there is a hint of discomfort. Upon returning to the office, she decides to take larger steps to minimize the pain. Taking off her shoes, she catches a glimpse of her feet and lets out a scream. The doctor confirms that her feet are beyond recovery. Feeling helpless, she walks barefoot back to the office. To make matters worse, a man accidentally steps on her foot. She unleashes a torrent of curses in pain. Little does she know, he is the company's chairman. Is the price for beauty worth this agony? What if someone deliberately takes your parking spot? Fuck you! In the cinema, what if someone takes off his shoes and yaps on the phone? Thanks for not talking during the feature. Thanks for turning off your cell phone. You're welcome. Frank was a law-abiding citizen until the day when he was diagnosed with a malignant brain tumor. With only a few months to live at most, he was stunned. He called his ex-wife, hoping to see his daughter before he died, but his daughter refused. 
Because there's nothing to do at your house. When he went to the office, the boss told him to leave because the receptionist accused him of harassment without even giving him a chance to explain. Frank lost the job he had for 11 years. In the evening, the sound of a baby crying came from next door. Frank couldn't sleep at all. He had approached the neighbor many times, but the neighbor not only ignored him, but also deliberately took his parking spot to block his car. Since talking didn't work, then... Fuck you! A guy is dancing with his girlfriend, but in the next moment... He goes to check, and shockingly, his girlfriend is accidentally knocked out. Just then, the doorbell rings, and the guy panics instantly. Unable to bury his girlfriend, he improvises. In a hurry, he hides her under the carpet. The door is already open. Trying to appear composed, he sits at the dining table. A lady walks in, complaining that the girlfriend isn't answering her calls. Yeah, well, you're a little bitch. Hearing this, the lady erupts in anger and rushes to confront the girlfriend. The guy, quick on his feet, hides behind the girlfriend, manipulating her body to communicate with the lady. Relax. I don't want any problems, okay? Too late, bitch. Oh, shit. Before the guy can fully comprehend the situation, the doorbell rings again. Turns out, it's the lady's boyfriend, thinking the girlfriend is upset with him for being late. The guy hurriedly explains himself. What's wrong? What did you do? No, what did you do? Man runs on the road for help. Suddenly... <laughs> after lifting the mask, the corn in the man's mouth turns into popcorn. Moments ago, the man was turned into a scarecrow by the villagers. A patrolling police officer passes by. The villagers are nervous, observing the bullets on the ground, and the blood slowly dripping from the scarecrow's body. Without a word, the police officer turns and runs away. However, it's too late. The car is intercepted halfway. He meets his end here. On the other side, the man, turned into a scarecrow, is not dead. With his last strength, he runs to the main road seeking help. However, due to the long stick on his head, he gets knocked out by lightning. Fortunately, the police arrive in time to rescue him. What a lucky guy. When Minecraft enters reality, everyone's faces turn square. To return to a round face, expensive plastic surgery is required. Square fruits become the norm. The price of round fruits has increased tenfold. Basketballs also become square, though difficult to dribble. Round basketballs have become a luxury item. Fish in the sea also turn square. People use square phones, listen to square records, use square machines. Tetris becomes the most popular game. No one wears round glasses anymore. Hairstyles and ice cream also become square. Even wheels have turned square. Would you be willing to come to such a world? When the wheels turn square, can bicycles still roll? Ever since square soccer fell from the sky, the entire world has become square. But this is just the beginning. People started playing with square basketballs, shooting them into square hoops. Hairstyles and ice cream have turned square. The whole earth has become square. Cars have become square, including their wheels. Driving feels like riding a tractor. The Ferris wheel has turned square. Even dog heads are square now. Square balloons. Square bubbles. Square donuts. Cartoons have also turned square. Doryman is now Dora Squaremon. It's truly a paradise for square faces.